Hello everyone, today I'm going to demonstrate some really cool, uh, another set of sliders that we came out with. These are Channel Slider D. Uh, they're sold in pairs just like our other sliders, uh, pretty inexpensive. Uh, but what they allow you to do is, uh, is, is really, really cool stuff, which I'll show you here in just a second. But as I said in the other videos, as you can see, these are made out of plastic. Uh, they're made out of Delrin, which is a really good, has really good wear characteristics. A lot of bushings are made out of Delrin. Uh, a lot of our sprockets, many of our gears are made out of Delrin. Just a really fantastic material. So, but we'll go ahead and get started. As you can see here, you can utilize these things with any number of different parts. You can use them with channel. You can use them with any of our quad hub mounts. I mean, basically anything that has our pattern in it, you can use these sliders with. So we're going to go ahead and I'll just bolt two of them together here utilizing one of our mounts so go ahead and get use some 632 by quarter head or quarter length socket head cap screws the other one here as you can see here this slider has two notches in it to be able to ride on top of the channel and then it's got a little uh, uh, curved notch in it that rides along the base of the channel of the, the perpendicular I'll go ahead and bolt these on I'm going to put another one in here. Like I said, you can do a combination. You can do a, that type of mount here. You can put, you know, this mount here. You can come in and put channel. You can come in and put a quad mount in. Whatever you want to do. Any, any kind of combination. You can run, you know, channel on both sides of it. That way you can have two pieces of channel sliding on, sliding on the, the third piece of channel. It's a lot of different combinations. Um, so, so we'll go ahead and get these screws in. Tighten them down. And also you'll see on the site, there'll be several different videos are already up showing uh, how you can mount some of our belt drives to these. Really, really simple to make. Camera sliders, dolly sliders, you know, um, any kind of robotic device. We need to have channel slide on another piece of channel. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and show you how this can actually just snaps right on. Um, now you've got a really nice, I mean, low, low friction slide, um, very little play. The tolerances in these things is really, really close, as you can see here. Um, the cool thing is, too, is that you can see we've actually got some parts or a part or two parts actually uh, mounted in this channel, yet the slide is not affected and slides right over the tops of the, tops of the uh, screw heads. We designed it that way because many times you're going to have belt drives, you're going to have gear drives inside, and you don't want, obviously, the sliders to be affected by that and to hit. So we've designed them so they actually just glide right past the screw heads and everything. So as you can see here, very, very smooth. This one's pretty neat because just, it'll just snap right on. So you just come in, place it on, snaps right on, very easy. Or obviously, you can run it right out the end. Um, so it works great for channel sliders, but obviously you can mount this many different directions. Um, unlike there are just our sliders that run on just the surfaces up here, this one says it snaps around. Um, very, very tight, easy to use. Um, you can have multiple cameras. You can have a GoPro on this one and a GoPro on this one pointing different directions. Of course, I'm not, this is not our longest piece of channel, but you can run on like our 24 inch pieces of channel and build a really nice long slider. So anyway, um, there you go. A lot of different options, a um, lot of different parts. Um, you can use them in combination. You run two of them on the same piece of channel and link them, link them with another piece of channel. So really unlimited opportunities. Build 3D printers. I mean, just, just about anything you can think of, you can use these sliders for. So anyway, part number 585-556, uh, channel slider D.